FEMA was very threatened by the provisions of the 2012 reform, which directed FEMA to allow private insurers to offer policies as long as they were equivalent to what FEMA offered. And FEMA knew, because of congressional direction, the cross-subsidies within the NFIP system and Anyone in, it's not Econ 101, but be a little beyond that, you learn that cross-subsidies are not sustainable unless entry is restricted. So FEMA faced no competition, but then it did, and then everyone at FEMA said, oh my goodness, that their own data show that their policies in Texas, Louisiana, and Florida, the vast majority of single-family homes in those states were overcharged, and they knew that private competition would cherry-pick them. So FEMA 2.0 is actually FEMA's response to the possibility and extent of private competition. 